Hi everyone, welcome back. Today is March 5th and I am here with our hop into spring sale. So it's not quite spring, but this is going to be our spring season sale and we are having 30% off the entire shop. We do have some exclusions that apply, but I feel like most of them are pretty obvious, like um, the subscription and um, the little like warehouse sale section. Actually, I don't know if I made that on sale or not. It may or may not be on sale, but I'm not sure. Um, but I'm pretty sure it's not. And then, um, because that's already discounted down to 50%. And then we have, um, the Dear Emmy section, which if you're not familiar with Dear Emmy, um, it's our like leather goods sister store that we're currently hosting on city stickers, but, um, we kind of like it's kind of, it's going to have its own website soon, so that's not on sale. But everything else is on sale. All the stickers, all the good things, um, the new releases. The new releases are also um, discounted, like how we do for all of our new releases, 10%. So you can like save all of that additionally on all these new things. So let's go ahead and just get into it. We have so much stuff that I want to show you. We have so many new foil sheets. Um, that are going to be permanently in the shop now that I keep getting requests for. So let's get started with that. Um, so we'll do the foil and then we have five new kits. Um, let's see if I can get the kits out of the frame. But um, yeah, so it is 30% off. The discount's automatic at checkout. Um, and it is going to be on sale through Sunday night. <laughs> Sorry, I had to sneeze. Um, the allergies are getting me. It's a perfect time for spring because I'm getting those spring allergies and they are killing me slowly. Let's start with the bigger sheets first. Um, so first we have these sketch Polaroid frames. Um, we did have these in the advent. Um, the advent, I like to show some new stickers and you get them ahead of time and you got them at a better price when you like price everything out appropriately but now they are available in the shop um because i had gotten some requests for them so they are the sketch polaroid frames and you get two different shapes or sizes i guess and you can see that the center is cut out on them just showing them here in gold but they are available in gold silver rose gold hollow and black and these are only available on white. They don't really make sense on transparent. So we just stuck with the white. So these are the sketch Polaroid frames. Another item that is now going to be permanently in the shop is the sketched box sampler. The number of requests that I got for these to be put in the shop after they were in the advent is actually crazy. So, um, yeah, they're available now. Um, if you didn't see this before, um, I can kind of explain now. It's like literally if you take our boxes page, which I guess we'll just take one here for one of these kits. But you see this boxes page and how it has the circles and the ovals, the squares, the midi boxes, the third boxes, and the quarter boxes. So it's like that, just like in sketch form. I feel like it's a really good complement to each other if you just want some simple boxes. So that is the sketch box sampler. Um, I'm going to skip to this one. And then, of course, to complement that, I don't know, I just thought this one was going to be fun. I don't know that I've specifically received any requests for this or anything, but I thought it was a good idea. Hopefully you also agree, but this is the classic lace box sampler. So it's like exactly the same but instead of sketched it's all lace shapes which this is the lace shapes that we already use in our kits anyway pulling that sheet again so we already have the lace like at the top here in the ovals and then turned all these boxes into lace all these were already lace and then made these lace and then made all these third and quarter boxes oh you can even see what i'm talking about these lace as well so i feel like this is a great sheet um and you get a good amount without having to buy like four or five different sheets. Um, 
but of course if there's like one shape that you prefer to use over the other I'm pretty sure that we just have the individual shapes in the shop as well but I wanted to do this little box sampler just thought it'd be fun again this is available in cold silver rose gold hollow and black actually so um yeah so there's that and then last for the bigger sheets we have this sheet music sampler you guys really like the old writing sampler um tay from shantae plans actually just did a little um like blurb not blurb like a reel on her page showing how she likes to use the old writing sampler um so i thought that the sheet music sampler would just be fun so you get four strips of the sheet music like washi you get I wouldn't necessarily call these dividers because some of them are pretty tall but they are really good for um I mean you could use them as dividers these ones over here are just single ones in height um and then over here these are all doubles so you have the single staff and the double staff here and then down here you get these little like blobs of music I don't know how to describe it it's the same way that it is with the old writing sampler where we have like little like um shapes with the writing but these are just like shapes with the music so I think that this is really freaking cute and I feel like the the music kind of vibe has been pretty popular along with the writing vibe from before so I just thought that it only made sense um Next we have these squiggle dividers. You get some bigger ones and some smaller ones on the sheet. Let me zoom in a little bit. So cute. Here we have these floral bricks. We did these last year and they were really popular for $2 Tuesday. And I have been nonstop getting requests to make these permanent in the shop. So your wish is my command. Um... I do think our butterfly sampler that we did recently has this on the sheet as well. Um, I thought I had the butterfly sampler over here, easily accessible next to me, but I don't think so. I wish I could show you guys my desk. It's kind of wild. <laughs> but anyway, here's the floral bricks all by itself. Um, a couple weeks ago, or I guess a couple months ago, we did some, uh, just like some basics to get your planner ready for the new year. And I actually got a lot of people saying that they missed these, which these are habit trackers. And I feel like habit trackers for a lot of people have become like a thing of the past, which is fine because a lot of people have been using their planner for like memory planning and such. But, um... I did think that these are really cute, so I just wanted to go ahead and put them in the shop for the people that are looking for something for habit tracking, but maybe just a little bit cuter than like a habit tracker that you might get in a kit. We don't have habit trackers in our kit anymore, but so here are the Polaroid ones. Super cute. And then these are the like just regular ones. So it has Monday through Sunday as like open circles, and then we give you the circles over here that you can fill them in with um if you are not very good at your habits you will have some of these circles left over but they're definitely versatile enough i think that you could like use them in your spread if you are not staying on top of your habits but yeah so we did went ahead and made these habit trackers permanent in the shop um Next, we have these typewriter stacked days. These are really, really popular when we release them for $2 Tuesday. So just want to go ahead and put them in the shop as well. Next, this is probably one of the most requested items that I've had. Oh, I'm missing a sheet now that I think about it. <sighs> okay, imaginations will have to be used. Um, so we have the dot dash divider, which has been one of the most requested sheets to be permanently in the shop. So that is available now. And then the matching washi is also available. And that is the sheet that I'm missing right now. I'm pretty sure I don't have it unless it got mixed in with one of these kits. But um, I think it's pretty self-explanatory what the washi would look like for this so it's fine whatever I'm sorry um but yeah so this is the dot dash divider 
Next we have some coffee rings. Again, I wanted to do a lot of staples. Um, so there's that. Here are these gilded edge trims. So these weren't in last year's advent, but they were in the advent the year before. And I've got, surprisingly, I've gotten a lot of requests for these recently. Um, so yeah, I will see if I can show you how to put them down on the planner in a little bit. But um, they are just cut perfectly to go with our torn paper. Um, and just give you a little peek of foil. And you get the left and the right. The left um, trim means that the like right corner goes on like the left side of your page if you're having it go like that. And then the right corner means right trim means that the corner goes on the right side of the page. So that is that. Next are these grid shapes, which if you got the January mystery, you should have gotten it by now. Um, this is from the January mystery, not the sheet specifically. We just had these three shapes, I think, on the mystery. Um, and um, I did give this mystery to some people in person. And no joke, every single person I gave this to was like, can you please bring these grid shapes to the shop? And I was like, okay. So now they're in the shop. <laughs> I like testing like fun new things in the mystery. So if you're not subscribed, it's not on sale during the sale, but it is a good deal. So, I hate to see fun things like that. Here we have some brush strokes. These are just really simple. Um, they actually kind of match, give me more sneak peeks. They kind of match like the foil like strokes that we have on some of like the watercolor shapes in our kits. But either way, they kind of just look like a brush stroke, but it's foiled and I think that is fun. You get two different sizes and they go in different directions. And then last but not least, you can actually thank Tara, Tara, for this one. Um, because this originally wasn't in my lineup. Um, but um, a lot of the PR team today is making posts about different things that they like from the shop. So you can get some ideas of some things to pick up while it's on sale. And <laughs> I'm going to call her out on this, but I love you, Tara. Um... She's like, oh, I did my post on the pixie dust, <laughs> but I realized you don't have the pixie dust in the shop. And I was like, you know what? I think we actually really need this pixie dust in the shop because it is so freaking dainty and beautiful and magical. So um, I'm only calling you out because I love that you did that um, because I really, really, really wanted to bring this to the shop and I forgot. So um, yeah, I think these are so beautiful. Um, you have these small ones here and then the bigger ones here. You can totally cut the bigger ones up to be smaller as well if you'd like. And I love her. So magical. So that is everything for the foil. We're 13 minutes into the video and I haven't shown one single of these five kits. But I'm just going to go ahead and grab here on top. And I guess we are starting with reminder. Let me zoom you out just a tad. You can kind of see that I have all these kits over here, but it's fine. So this is Reminder, and it is in Champagne Gold Foil. This sale, we actually do have one kit at least in each of the foil colors, so patting myself on the back for that. Um, this is called Reminder. As I said, the quote says, May the flowers remind us why the rain wasn't so necessary. Um, here you have some trees with some like, sparkles. These flowers are so beautiful. Here is a little book. We have this little picnic scene with some blueberries. Fun fact, I hate blueberries, but my daughter loves them. Um, and a basket of flowers. Um, and then we have another kind of table scene here with more flowers and some a drink. I'm not going to speculate what that drink is. And then another kind of tree scene. The colors in this kit are so freaking beautiful. Look at those. This is like the most dreamy pastel without being like, like bright, but it's also like not what I would consider muted. It's just a beautiful pastel palette. So you have a blue color, a green, a yellow, and a pink. I guess the blue is more like periwinkle-ish. So pretty with the gold. I love the gold on that yellow and that green. 
Here are the headers. You have the this like leafy pattern on the header, the floral headers, the lace in that green color. Here are the shapes, the torn paper, and then these journaling things. I just realized I didn't even show you those gilded edges. I need to show you those in a second. Um, here is the bottom washi. Again, the leaf pattern matching, that beautiful flower. Wow, I love these flowers so much. Um, and then that matching lace strip, your days of the week, and some deco. Here is the add-on, the foil add-on, I guess I should say. You get that same leafy pattern. If you don't want to use the leaves, like in this strip like that, you could cut up the leaves individually. Um, you have some flowers and some lemon or I guess citrus slices, some jars, some baskets, and then some of that pixie dust from earlier. But the pixie dust really does complement this kit super well, especially with how like sparkly these trees are. I think it's really pretty. Here is the deco add-on. Window, the book, flat lay, and then some table with some a table with some books and then that same table from that one um, full box as well. Here is the journal add-on. Again, loving these colors. The floral deco add-on. These florals are so pretty. And the alcohol ink swatch add-on, which I think lets you see, peel that sticker up before, this lets you see the colors really well I feel like. So that is everything for the reminder kit. I'm really debating on if I want to show you the torn paper now while I have, while I'm remembering, but I don't know that I really want to like cut in the middle of the video. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to go ahead and do it right now before I forget um, because my ADHD will get the best of me if I don't do it right now, I feel like. Um, so this is just, I don't want to ruin one of this week's kits, so this is just a kit from last week. Um, and this is what I'm talking about with the, um, can I peel the sticker up please? There we go. This is what I'm talking about it with it being right oriented versus left. I'm actually going to use the back of the sheet to kind of demonstrate for you. So. This is what I mean with right, where the right angle goes right on the right side of the page. Whereas like if this was rotated like this way, this is the sticky side down, this is on the left side of the page. Um, normally I would do this in a reusable sticker book, but I'm not sure that I have one in here right now. But I would just do this on a reusable sticker book, pretend this is a reusable sticker book. And you can just put your sticker down on top of this gilded edge and it contours perfectly because I made the gilded edge and I'm, I made the torn paper. Whether or not this will work with other people's kits, um, I don't know because I don't, I don't design their kits. Um, let's see if I can get this peeled up without ruining the paper underneath. I don't think that's going to happen, so it's fine, it's fine. Um, but yeah, that is the Gilded Edge with the torn paper. And yeah, like I said, we normally do this in a reusable sticker book where I could peel this up and put it down. I feel like that's the easiest way to put these down, by the way. Um, but I don't have one right next to me right now, so um, that'll have to do. But yeah, so that is the torn paper strips. Um, if you're interested in those. Moving back on to the kits now. <laughs> um, next we have a gold foil kit. I guess I should say champagne gold foil. It's called Perennial and it has a lot of daisies. Um, the quote says pick daisies and have a happy heart. Up here we have a little food scene with some foiled daisies and flowers. We have this really beautiful window with a little flower garland and some butterflies. Lots of daisies throughout this really pretty outfit flat lay with a camera and some Polaroids. We have this girl laying in the daisy field. 
And then we have this chair here with some foiled daisies and butterflies around it. Here is the color palette. It is so beautiful and calming. I feel like with this color palette, I would typically go with silver, but the gold with daisies is just unmatched. So two shades of green and two shades of blue here. Here is the functional add-on. You have this really pretty dotted daisy header pattern in it. And you get two paper strips here that have daisies and two that are just a watercolory design, I guess I would say. Here is the gorgeous bottom washi. I love that dotted daisy again. And then the daisy washi. How many times can I say daisy? The lace does match with that light blue. You have your date covers in the green color. And this deco is really pretty. You get this dress some flowers, this lantern, a teapot, a vase, and a pair of shoes. Here's the foiled add-on. You have the daisy washi and dividers. You have that kind of daisy garland that was on the windowsill, some individual little daisy flowers, um, and some like daisy like clusters, some butterflies, some Polaroid stacks, and two little windows. Here is the deco add-on. You have two girls sitting in the grass reading that chair scene, but it's flipped. You get that same dress from the full boxes and also an overall option. And this really pretty hat, a lantern, and then of course a bunch of daisies and flowers. Here is the functional add-on. These stamps do have the two full boxes of the girl and the window. Here is the floral deco add-on. If you are a big fan of daisies, I would just grab this floral deco add-on. It is jam-packed with daisies. It is so much fun. And the alcohol ink swatch add-on. Moving on to our third kit. This kit is in rose gold foil. Lots of feedback last week saying that you guys are here for spring kits with rose gold foil and I've got you. Um, we've got this kit and then we've got um, another kit coming in like two-ish weeks, I think, um, with rose gold foil. So I've got you with the rose gold foil. It's been noted. Um, anyway, it's called this one's called Daisy, which is funny because the other one is like about daisies, but this one is like less daisy. I don't know how to explain. Whatever, it's fine. Um, here is this little tree swing scene with some foiled flowers down at the bottom. Lots of beautiful little foiled flowers throughout like with this abstract scene in the background. Really pretty creek scene with some foiled ripples and like grass on the side. The quote says, nature has music for those who listen. Foiled rocks and flowers with this little kind of like arch out in the wild. And this beautiful little field scene with some, I guess, bees out in the field. Very pretty. If you're a purple person, I hope you're happy. This is really pretty. Um, here we have two different shades of purple, a dark purple and a lighter purple. And then we have a green and a yellow. Here is the functional. We have some daisy headers, the foiled florals, and the lace. And the bottom washi as well. So again, you have that daisy thin strip and the foiled florals, the little thin headers, and the lace. And then we have some deco here. Here is the daisy add-on. Someone called me. Is it important? Probably not. Let's see. No. <laughs> um, I keep getting calls of people wanting to buy my house. I also get calls of people trying to sell me solar panels for my house. Um, I'm going nuts answering these calls and I always think that it's important because sometimes delivery people will call me so I feel like I have to answer unknown callers all the time. It drives me crazy. Anyway, here is the daisy foil add-ons. We have that 
daisy washi and header we have a lot of little daisy pieces here um this is really it's kind of funny so this kit is called daisy but i feel like it's not like too daisy heavy and the last kit was called daisy um the last kit was called perennial but it's more daisy heavy but i feel like you could use both of these samplers with both of these kits does that make sense so like you could pick up the perennial sampler in rose gold and use it with daisy and you can pick up the daisy sampler in gold and use it with perennial i don't know i just think that's so cute anyway here's the foil add-on if you're a daisy lover you are in luck this release um yeah so here's the deco add-on she's so beautiful i love these flowers and all these little statues and such so pretty and the journal add-on has that field scene and that other kind of statue scene. Um, here is the floral deco add-on. I love how much green is incorporated into these. Oops, let me make sure I'm in frame. So pretty. And then the alcohol ink swatch add-on. I say this every video, but I always show the alcohol ink swatch add-on in white because it's easiest to see, but picking that up in transparent is by far the most popular, um, like the most popular option when people are shopping usually. Um, next we have petals, which is our silver kit of this release. And she's gorgeous. So we have a tree swing here with some foiled flowers in the tree excuse me i have the, kind of like the hiccups now we have this really pretty flower shop with this girl coming out foiled the quote says may the petals teach me the art of letting go um we have this really pretty scene with some scrapbook layering going on here with some foiled flowers it's really pretty front door scene with a foiled lantern and some foiled flower pots oops the add-on is falling out um here is kind of like scrapbooky postage stampy we have a postage stamp and then this says carte postal i'm probably not pronouncing that correctly but that's okay um some polaroids and then of course the foiled florals this color palette is so dreamy love her Th this type of color palette will always be one of my favorite of all time i really love these dusty rose colors with greens and creams so pretty in the silver is beautiful really could not have gone wrong with any foil with this kit but i feel like silver is just so freaking beautiful had to do it headers are butterflies I do some foil wiggles here for you to see trying to make a better habit at looking at the um the monitor while i'm talking um and then here is the bottom washi more foiled butterflies we have tons of butterfly stuff in the shop. We even have like a giant butterfly sampler, um, foil-wise at least. Um, so I would definitely check that out for this kit because you can get 30% off of that this whole week. So check that out. Here are the date covers and your deco. Here is the foil add-on. Lots of butterflies. You have some like dandelion cluster deco some like lily pads, some swings, and some of those flowers, and then you have some like postage, postage stamp deco that's foiled. Really pretty. Here is the deco add-on with a, the flower shop, a boat, a ladder, the tree, and the front door, and of course florals. The journal add-on. The floral deco add-on. And the alcohol ink swatch add-on. So beautiful. And then last but certainly not least, we have the pure kit, which is in gold foil. This is so pretty. Here we have this little kind of cafe, outdoor cafe scene with this foiled girl, florals. 
this girl next to the window with some flowers in her hand and a really pretty like clip or flower in her hair. The quote says, peaceful mind, grateful heart. Really pretty cake. This is good for like a spring birthday if you wanted it to be like subtle. You could totally put this on like the birthday part. I forgot that my camera stops recording after a certain point, so that's fun. Um, I really hope that didn't cut me off too bad, but as I was saying, hopefully it's in, is that I feel like this kit would work well for if you have someone's birthday that week, maybe not necessarily your birthday. I feel like when it's my birthday, I want the whole kit to be birthday centered. But this one's good because you could put the cake on a, um, gosh, what's the word I'm looking for? The cake on the day of the week that it's someone's birthday if you wanted to. I'm in this really pretty scene with some foiled petals. Um, this might also be really cute for Easter too. I don't know why I associate desserts with Easter, but there's that. Here is the, um, gosh, I'm like dropping all these pages now. Here's the boxes page. It's a different color palette. There's like, not really like a pinky color. It's more of like a taupey and like an orange -y peach color and a green. Really pretty with the gold foil. Here is the functional page. Just a simple confetti header. The washi page. Simple confetti washi that matches. The thin headers, the um, lace washi, the foiled florals, and then the deco which has some butterflies, a moped, and some more like cake elements. Now I'm dropping everything. Here is the foil add-on. You have the confetti here, and then some like confetti cluster deco almost. You have some of these spring girls wearing like dresses and other cute outfits. This really pretty like bistro chair scene, some benches, and then some little lanterns. It's kind of giving like Spring City vibes. You have this girl reading here, some florals. This is the deco add-on, by the way. Um, the Some butterflies and a dragonfly. That outdoor kind of like bistro scene, a moped cake, bicycle, and this really pretty girl here with some flowers in her hair. Here is the journal add-on. The floral deco add-on. Oosh. Yeah. And the alcohol ink swatch add-on. So yeah, that is everything for today. Um, I hope that you enjoy this week's new releases and our sale. Um, went a little crazy on the releases, but I think it's all good. It's fine, right? Having options is fun. It's fine. Um, so yeah, the entire shop is 30% off in case you missed the entire other 33 minutes of the video. Um, discount is automatic, like I mentioned. All of these new releases are discounted, including the foil. Here's all the foil, too. Tons of foil sheets. Um, so definitely don't miss out. Also, if you aren't familiar, we do have free shipping on orders over $100 if you're in the U.S. Um, and that applies um, after the discount. So yeah, so that is everything. Um, I just wanted to quickly go over my head, make sure I didn't forget to mention anything. Uh, let's just kind of start from the top. So the sale starts today, March 5th, and will run until March 10th at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is Sunday um, night. Um, don't forget that we have daylight savings time change on Sunday and Saturday night. Um, that doesn't, I mean, I guess that technically gives you one less hour to shop because we spring forward, but still. Um, it is 30% off the entire site. I did mention the exclusions earlier in the video um, and the discounts automatic so you don't need a code. 
Um, what else? What else? What else? We have five new kits, new foil. We have some new pens and stationery and highlighters and stuff in the shop, so I would check that out too. Um, and yeah, I think that's everything. Oh, we have uh, freebies on all orders, and then we have freebies for orders that are fifty dollars plus, one hundred dollars plus, and two hundred dollars plus. Um, so adjust your cart accordingly if you are interested in receiving those freebies but either way I hope that you enjoy this week's sale and yeah let me know down below which kit this week is your favorite and what items you plan on picking up um, and I will talk to you guys later bye